Big week, big season for Clay Helton. Big week looking toward the future with uh, Mr. Justin Flo in town, one of the top recruits in the nation. Uh, your thoughts about what's happening there and uh, some indications of where he's leaning. Well, as, as if people remember, Justin Flo had USC out of his top five. I, I know a lot of people, um, and especially the Crystal Balls, had USC as a heavy favorite. However, recent developments that I saw happen um, was that Justin Flo, one, uh, one of the top linebackers in the nation and in California, was in USC gear before his game against um, uh, before his, his game last week. I don't remember the opponent, but um, I know he I, I believe Scott Schrader from USC Scoop said that he had USC gear on during that game and that I believe he has an upcoming visit at USC coming up. So things could sway here. We saw what happened with Bryce Young and him flipping his commit to Alabama and, and we thought he was a lock for USC. Things could change here for, you know, for for Justin Flo where USC could creep back into the into the mix. Next thing you know it come signing day it could be something completely different he he hasn't committed yet or anything but right now i don't know it looks like usc is getting back into the mix for justin flo justin flo is the number one rated inside linebacker in the country according to all the major services uh number one rated player in the state of california out of upland high school in upland california according to the 247 composite right now uh, they're leaning Clemson, but with USC right there in the mix as well. Other teams that are hot on uh, Justin Flo's trail and that he is definitely considering, again, according to the 247 rankings, would be Clemson, Georgia, Miami, Oregon, in addition to the USC Trojans. So um, obviously got to keep those uh, California kids in state, and he is ranked as the very best. Matt, we appreciate you stopping by. Uh, hope you enjoy the game, and uh, we could have a whole lot of interesting uh, USC talk coming down the stretch if they're able to ha hang in this Pac-12 South Division race. Yes, it's going to be it's going to be a fun one. Uh, and I'll be in attendance for it too, so it should be a very fun one. Awesome, thanks, Matt. We appreciate it. Thank you for having me.